DNA gets into the aquatic environment. And there's a, a, a hypothesis out there that if DNA sticks to surfaces in the environment, it will protect it from undergoing any degradation. So um, when I think about that problem, I, I think about there are a myriad of surfaces in the environment. Are they going to all behave like that? And so we just started some work looking at DNA absorbed onto oxide, mineral oxide surfaces and determining whether it stays, its structure stays intact. The B form is the typical form. It has a certain handedness. It has a certain structure. structure. And what we've learned so far is that it really depends on the mineral, what DNA is doing, what its structure is on the surface, and we use spectroscopy as a probe of that. And so that's been a recent exciting uh, result of ours that we're, we really want to get in the literature soon, and we're just writing up some of our initial papers. And once you do, you know, that's a big topic, and once you do one thing, there's then a hundred other things that you want to do. Mm -hmm. And what's satisfying from my perspective is uh, one of my first papers that I ever wrote was on DNA. And that was many, many, many years ago. So it's, wow. it's coming full circle mm -hmm. and we're looking at DNA and its structure once again.